Welcome to the latest edition of the Wallace State News for Monday, February 20th. I'm Katie Rogers. And I'm Kai Kreider. Today we'll be looking at the latest news and updates for this upcoming week. Come out and celebrate homecoming tonight. The Wallace State Lions basketball teams will take on Shelton State beginning with the women's at 5.30 p.m. and the men's game at 7 p.m. The crowning of homecoming queen and presentation of the court will be during halftime of the men's game. The deadline to apply for Wallace State transfer scholarships is this week. Applications are due by no later than February 22nd. Scholarships to universities include the University of Alabama, UAB, the University of West Alabama, Jacksonville State, and the University of Montevallo. Contact Financial Aid for more information. Last week, the Borough Museum began hosting an exhibit of a local photographer and author, David Haynes. The exhibit will be open February 14th through March 31st. Haynes' latest book, Motorcycling in Alabama, was published by the University of Alabama Press last year, and the exhibit will feature photography from this project. There will also be an artist lecture scheduled in March. In an effort to promote a healthier environment, Wallace State has adopted a clean air policy that began in the 2011 fall semester. The use of tobacco and smoking is now limited to vehicles only. Beige cigarette containers located on campus are for disposal only and still a no smoking zone. Tickets are on sale now for Wallace State Singers' performance of Everybody Dance Now. Performances will be March 1st through the 3rd. Tickets are $7 for adults and $5 for students. For more information, please call 256-352-8277. Are you interested in writing for the student newspaper? If you want to join the main issue staff, come by on Wednesdays at 3 p.m. in the graphics lab located on the second floor of the Burroughs Center or you may email us at newspaper at wallacestate.edu. Please check back next week on February 27th for the latest news and updates. I'm Katie Rogers. And I'm Kai Kreider. Thanks for watching this edition of the Wallace State News.